In the old days, when my dad and I would go on a canoe trip, pack all our stuff into wicker baskets, <laughs> let the bugs in and the smells out, and they sunk every time we flipped over, which happened on a regular basis. Then dad got a great big metal cooler. It had sharp edges, rusted faster than a Studebaker, and weighed more than our fridge. <laughs> I'll tell you, the guy who thought that a metal box would make a great insulator should have spent a winter in a garden shed. But eventually, science got into the atomic age and produced the miracle substance, Holly want a cracker lean. Finally, a cooler you could lift, huh? And it even floats, unlike Dad. And these things close up airtight, which is great when you're taking food to the campsite or bringing dirty laundry home. <laughs> now, that cooler in the canoe, sure, was a big step forward, but why just take one step, eh? If you have enough coolers and the handyman's secret weapon, you can take it to a whole new level. <laughs> I call it the canooler. <laughs> <laughs>